Later. Okay, we gotta do this really, really quick because we got like five contests to enter, okay? Okay. So be quick. Okay, we're doing uh, Sparky's 500 slash 600 uh, oh, sub yes. contest. Okay. Okay, Robert. we're not prepared because you said you had matches and they ain't here. <sighs> okay. Okay, get, get the housekeeping out of the way so you hurry. I am the... not speed doing this. Yeah. So please knock it off. Alright, fine, fine, fine. Here. I hate when you speed because you don't understand. She's smoking. In honor of Sparky. Sparky. And of course, you put the jar up. I needed the jar. Sparky! The jar Sorry. He's messing with me here, people. God. I wanted the jar. Scott! So that's what we're smoking. Scott! Scott! You gotta do it like I do it. Oh, I'm sorry. Like he's frozen. <laughs> In my Peterson bulldog. Which should be mine. Which is mine. <laughs> and you can shove it. Yes, dear. <sighs> and I'm are. going to smoke the one Q. Out of my King Kong Gorilla Pipe with this smirk. Check out the smirk. Yeah. Ooh, that's my Sparky Pipe. Okay. I'd say it was a self-portrait, but you didn't make it. Uh-huh. So funny. Alright, Sparky's Pipes. Here we go with the ten questions to enter your contest. You have go. to start. Cause, no, you start because I like the two questions that I want to do. You're starting. Are we Are we answer, Are we we both answering these questions? Yeah, you, you answer first, I answer second. Because oh. ladies first. Then you should go first. Age before beauty. Then ah. you should still go first. Uh, it didn't work out, did it? <laughs> What is your favorite sometimes. pipe shape? I'm smoking it. This has become my favorite pipe shape. Bulldog. Ah. Uh, my favorite pipe shape. <coughs> is a cow dash. That's my favorite. It's only f I just because I just I s I associate it with, with, you know, Sherlock Holmes and it's just old English looking. But it's a combination of that and any church warden. And that's, everybody knows why I like church wardens. Okay, next question. Favorite Muppet? Your favorite Muppet is? I have to pick one? <laughs> to. Scott, really? You know me. You really think I can pick one Muppet? But I guess top of the, you know... Top of the order would be Kermit. Oh, you know, probably ought to do. Have Turn a moment with us. It's not even on. Mm. Cool. Did you not notice what was on? My favorite Muppet. Mm. <laughs> Me. <laughs> it's really tough. Uh, probably the first one that I ever saw was Ralph. Am I saying it right? Rolf. Rolf. R O L Old, no R O W L F. Okay, well, Rolf. he was a piano playing dog. He was my you know, Jim Henson did the voice, and he he appeared. Matter of fact, first time I ever saw it was in black and white. Yeah, that's how old I am. Black and white television. I think I saw him on some show, and Rolf was sitting there playing the piano. It was on. Oh, you know what? Was it a? Um, was it a Dean Martin? It might have been. I think it was a Dean Martin. It might have been a Dean Martin, Martin. but it was it was old. Whatever it is. I can't pick a real favorite. Current day, Kermit. which is not Kermit, it would be uh, Grover. Hello, everybody. Which is Yoda. Which is Yoda. <laughs> <laughs> and Kermit. Jedi have points. big lightsaber. Super. Yeah, Frank Oz and a fantastic voice guy, Frank Oz. All right. Next question. If you, I'm sorry, who started your pipe smoking hobby? You. Me. You. How'd I do oh, that? Damn it. <laughs> Match went out. Oh, I know. Because I would never have done this. Yeah. If it hadn't been for you and Pops. Mm. I didn't know squat. Peer pressure. Uh huh. You want to try it? You want to try it? Come on. Oh, just come on. You want to try it? Welcome to my world. Yeah. That's okay. I don't mind it at all. When I was 16, I was... I'm working back. as a historical recreation in the old Fort Fort Wayne actor. Um, we played soldiers from like the 1860s in uh, Fort Wayne, Indiana. Um, General Matt Anthony Wayne, they built a fort there and all that. 
and I was Private Zebediah Richardson, the drummer of the troop mm -hmm. and the Cooper. Cooper is the guy that builds barrels. Thank you, because I had no idea what that was. That's a Cooper. Um, and part of the character thing, we had clay pipes. So we got, I have no idea what tobacco we smoked in these clay pipes. Probably wasn't tobacco. And it shows you the difference of the time, because this is 1976 or 1975, and I'm smoking. I'm 16 years old, and they don't care. I got a clay pipe, and I'm smoking out of this clay pipe. That's the first time I ever smoked a pipe, but since then, I never smoked a pipe since. That's right. Until Dad passed away, and I went to Arizona to get his things and finish up all the stuff and I saw his pipe collection and went out and smoked a pipe of his uh, Beckler Meersham and then when I came home then you were with me so you know all the mm -hmm. all the I stuff where I was like well I took some of his tobacco home with me and we tried it out and the first thing I ever smoked was um, Admiral's Choice, Choice Vanilla Cavendish thought that was great because like the first month it was nothing but uh, aromatics. And I always thought that, you know, oh my god, a lot of Kia and, and Perique, that stuff's nasty. But now... First time we ever smelled um, Perique in the, in the tobacconist, it was like, whoa! Mm -hmm. But and now, now I can't it. stand it. Now pretty much the only thing I'll smoke that's aromatic is 1Q and Moons of Isengard. Everything else is in English or straight Virginia. If you were a fish, which fish would you be? I think I'd have to be a great white shark. Like the Jaws monster, you know. <laughs> I, the, <laughs> I love that shark. I'm sad when they when they shot the, the oxygen tank in the shark's mouth and they blew him into a bunch of sushi. <laughs> I haven't seen that movie in forever. Great movie. I was a kid when I saw it. That. It doesn't hold up. At, well, it holds up, but the special effects don't hold up. No, because now we. <laughs> it's so different. But it was that movie was awesome, and the book was even better. There's a book. Yeah, Jaws. Peter Benchley. I didn't. I didn't honestly, I really didn't know that. Yeah, I read the book. It was one of the first times I read a book before I saw a movie. <laughs> I do that now. I won't watch the movie till I read the book. Yeah. But it was Hunger Games. Smart. So. Your favorite? If you were a fish, what kind of fish would you be? I'd be a dory, which is a blue tang. A blue what? <laughs> tang. A blue tang. That's what it is. Okay. Did you not read it when we looked it up? It's a blue tang. I was going for a joke. Anyway. Yeah, there's no <laughs> joke there. Shut up. <laughs> Leave me alone. Yeah, she's a dory. I want to be able to forget. <laughs> which is interesting because she's never uh, done anything that would affect her memory. And like I remember dory. everything. That's yeah, the problem. Dory can't remember what she did five minutes ago. That's what I'd like I to I probably do. should be a blue tang. Yeah, because no, you know that. I, you always try to get out of stuff, and I remember everything. Mm -hmm. So, I'd be, I'd be dory. What's your favorite tobacco? One Q. Sure, <laughs> yeah, that, that, that definitely is one of my favorites. It's... I like that one. It always is. I told you that before, but yeah, I have to go with Scott on this one. That's so hard. I have, yes. I have a lot of favorite tobacco. He likes pirate cake. That's his favorite. <laughs> Arr, <Mickey. laughs> No, pirate cake's good. Um, Penzance, probably my favorite. I really like Stonehaven the first time we tried it. Now but I then know. now it's kind of like I don't quite get it. It's it's overrated, and you know I'm like right I've got I'd like to trade somebody. I've got a bunch of, of Stonehaven. And if somebody wants to trade me some Penzance for it, man, I'm all about it. How about we get something we don't have? I like Penzance. Oh, I know you do. Okay, but you have enough Penzance to last a lifetime. No, I don't. I need more. Um, what? Oh, this is a trick What question. animal or thing do you most despise? Stupidity. That's the thing I most despise. Okay. Honestly, and I'm not going to go any further, but uh, just all around. Stupidity. <laughs> That's the thing. In life, I cannot stand it. There you go. My animal I despise. Hard question. I hate fire ants. There's no friggin' reason in the world they need to be here. They serve no purpose. <laughs> um, they don't. And as far as a thing I despise, yep, that, that is uh, willful ignorance and in and intolerance. Willful yeah, ignorance and intolerance is, I can't deal with that. Um, 
Your favorite place to smoke a pipe? Right here. Oh, uh, you know my favorite place to smoke a pipe is? Anywhere you can? Nope. In my mouth. Oh! Because I've tried it in my ear. You tried it up your nose? It sucks the bag. Oh, that was... No, it's in the mouth is where it needs to go. Now I'm going to taste my burgers so weird. when I, I, I do this. I got it on. Oh. Um, make a funny face, huh? <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> All you got to do is look at the camera. That's right. There's my <laughs> there you're funny smart face. ass. Bitch. Hang on, hang on. Let me. I saw. <gasps> you what? just called me. Okay. I did not. No, I didn't. You did too. No, um, the best face I've seen so far in the funny face vids is uh, uh, Miko, Edge of Flame. He went. <laughs> and that was great. It was a great face. I laughed out loud on that one. Okay, um. So make a funny face. I just did. No, you made Miko's face. That's not fair. Sakes, okay. Do your own. Oh, God, you can do better than that. It doesn't make a face when you got it. When you. When, the beard. I can't make a face. You can make a face with the beard. Alright, Twazilla. Hang on. <gasps> oh! That's not a funny face either. That's a funny sound. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> um. Sorry, Scott. <sighs> there you go. That's better. Okay, good. Thank you. Um, Most desired pipe and who makes it? It's tough. This is my most desired pipe. Oh, you were going to say F. Fight. That's why you were saying the F. Um, at the time. Oh, wait a minute. Um, other one was the most desired pipe. Was this one. By Patrick the Pipe. <laughs> I'm so good. <laughs> yeah, that sucker. I mouthed it Did before you, really? you got there. <laughs> yeah, that sucker is awesome. With the wacky Welsh. That was the first time he did the, the, wacky, uh, Welsh. the wacky Welsh bend in it and everything. Wacky Welsh uh, Yeah. Stem. Um. Currently, what I'd, I'd like to have, I haven't got yet, is it's like a tie. It's it's um, a Chris Morgan pipe. He showed me one the other night, but it's way out of my league. Um, Hi, puppy. Yeah, oh, definitely uh, one. I want to get one of yours. Uh, I'm going to say Giacomo. 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 I was calling him Giacomo. But he's Giacomo. Giacomo. No, Giacomo pipe would have been a good thing to get if he ever comes back and he makes pipes again. But... Um, Almost everybody that makes pipes out there, almost all you guys, I want I want a Joe Case pipe, I want a, uh, why can't I remember definitely ones? Geo. Geo pipes, I want a Geo pipe. Um, all these unique independent maker pipes, I know I'm forgetting people, a Beans pipe, I want a Beans pipe. Uh, help Basically me. we'd like a pipe from everyone I'm on here. We've got to win the lottery, so any of your pipe makers on there, that's who we would like. Thank you, because I'm going to forget names. Um, forget him, he's old. That's right. And forgetful. That's really nice of you to say that. And I just, it's all my though. <laughs> I can't remember half of them either. Oh. But um, I really want a Sparky's pipe. And a Skull Yonic. I want a Yonic Skull. But they're like, the ones I want are going to be about two to three hundred dollars. I want a Chris I Morgan cigar. Pipe. You want a Chris Morgan cigar, cigar pipe? I don't want a cigar. I have to say that. Briar cigar. The Briar cigar. Yeah. Yeah. Those are cool too, like dude. That. Matches looks really cool when he smokes it. It's really cool. I haven't seen him do it. Because you're not paying attention. That's probably right. Glad you're not on Facebook, so yeah. Last one. Why is pipe smoking important to you? I didn't write <laughs> Why is Mark not able yeah. to write all the words? Why is important to you is what I wrote. <laughs> I can understand it says, what is important to you? No, why is but part... No, part? Par oh, God. Jesus Christ. I swear we've only had one shot. Why is pipe smoking important to you? I just say just with the YouTube part of it, I've met so many neat people and made so many new friends that that's I'm I'm a, I like having I like my friends I like my close knit friends and I'm a people person unlike some people I know I like to be around people I like to have different people in my life so that's what this has brought into me that's very important to me is my friendships plus it's something we actually have in common. Which that's is really nice cool. That, that's that's, it's nice very thing. rare to find a couple that have something in common that they can actually enjoy to do together. And this is one of those things because it's an oddity also to have a pipe smoking couple, which luckily we have a few of us on YouTube as well. But you don't see, it's something that 
you know, we enjoy together, we discuss together, you know, and all that kind of stuff. So it's, it's, yeah, tonight. it's fun, and it's, it, that's very important to have something in common that we can enjoy together. Why it's important to me is because it brings me close to Dad. Yeah. You're in the symbol. Okay. And all that's how it is. So thank you, Scott. Thank you, thank you. Congratulations, brother. Nobody's more deserving of the subscribers that they have than you. You're, you're a awesome. wonder, You're a stand-up guy. We love you. Even when you're sitting down, you're a stand-up guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I think you're frozen. <laughs> Scott! Scott! Hey, Scott! Keep on popping. 